Hello fellas, welcome to my channel. Let's go straight to the point. A few days ago, I downloaded the latest version of Kali Linux and I updated it. But for some reason, I was not able to start my OpenVAS. As you can see here in the, the forum, on the forum, you will see that many people are reporting that Noto Scanner won't start. Some of them are having issues like this one, error, you give them 23.11 not yet completed so the thing is people are not able to start GVMs are not able to run OpenVS on Kali Linux and today I'm going to show you how to solve that let me show you the actual scenario here here I have the latest version of Kali Linux full updated because this for some people these are happening after they upgrade Kali Linux for the latest version. For me, I just downloaded the virtual machine directly from Kali Linux website and I ran here OpenVAS. You will see here that I'm full updated, upgraded. There is no package needing to be updated. As you can see here, all packages are up to date. If I check my Kali version, you will see here I'm using the latest one, 2000. 24.1 this is the latest version of kali linux but when i go let me go to the other tab when i go to start open vas provide the password here okay many of you are getting this error right here you're not able to execute if and even if you go to check the setup you will see that if i come here and i check the setup for example evm check setup you will see that i'm still sh seeing this error right here as you can see here the same error with this information ospd open vest service did not start this is the problem if you are not able to start this service you are not going you are not going to be able to run open vest to solve this problem what we need to do we need to install something what happens is kali linux updated many packages in Kali Linux but as you know OpenVAS on Kali Linux is maintained by the Kali Linux team not by the Greenbone team so to correct this problem we need to follow some steps this is a workaround to allow us to run OpenVAS all right to do that I'm going to go to this last tab here now on this terminal here this new tab what I'm going to do, I will open a file, a txt file I have with all the commands we are going to use. But you can find the same in the description below. To do that, I will just type this command here and open my file. What we need to do, we need to run all of these commands right here. The first one is this one. We are going to clone the package we want. And after that, we are going to install this package. To get started, let's just copy this one the first one we don't need to type it just copy and let me paste here make sure you you do this running has root okay and after that let me hit enter provide the sudo password it is now cloning the package i want from github the process is quite fast and then the second step we need to get in in this folder using this command you can just copy and paste just to be quick and hit enter the second step is to run this command here type install hyphen e space dot very important you need to make sure you include this dot right here and hit enter the installation will start it takes less than five minutes depending on your internet okay we go here we go it's installing now all right the installation is completed this is the reason why we are not able to start up in VAS and we are getting the error when we when we, we start the service why because we have this OSPD open VAS service in and the version is 22.7.1 but this service requires redis 4.5.0 and Kali Linux, the system, has this version here. It means that the Kali team must update these packages, this package here. 
right this is not responsibility of greenborn greenborn has the latest ver version of osp ospd service but kali linux not so they need to update this package after that we will not have this kind of issues right here preventing us to start open vest this is the reason why we are having this issue this is the reason why but what we are going to to do now we are going to use a workaround all right to solve this problem too so for now just ignore this message and come here the next step after we install is to is this step fourth let me just cut and paste here and hit enter to get in and now we need to type this command here we need to copy this this file here the client.py and we need to install on this path let me just copy and paste and hit enter okay so now we can check setup again let me just tap this one let let's not be lazy <laughs> sudo evm check setup and hit enter let's see now let me just close these tabs here we don't need this for now let's remain with this one let's see the message we are going to get now checking the setup again to make sure everything is okay before we start the GVM now is starting the OSPD service it's waiting if we don't succeed here in starting this service we will not we will keep getting the same error but if we succeed as you can see here now is okay now it's checking the other packages like post degree service the version all of that almost there this process of checking the setup it starts all the necessary service checks if all the necessary services are able to start okay as you can see here it seems like your GVM installation is okay we just solved the problem we are not getting the same error as before all right so now let me go back to my root and let's type now sudo GVM start let's start all right so now we are getting this message here gvm service are already running why because during the check setup this process started all the necessary services so what we need to do now we just need to go to the browser because gvm service is already already running let's see now here we go let me maximize this and now i need to open up this is the address to open okay let me hit enter here we go as you can see now we succeed admin ad and my password and sign in here we go as you can see we managed to log in into greenborn security assistant okay we managed to solve the problem that was preventing us to access gvm okay so we managed to log in here all right so this is how you are going to correct the issue all right this is all for this video please subscribe share the video and from now on i would like to challenge you just write on the description below what you want me to teach you or what kind of video you want me to make related to openvest and i will do my best to, pr to produce that video and upload in youtube all right see you bye bye